Could you be cheating on your partner and not even know you're doing it? Well, studies have shown that around 23% of married men and 12% of married women have at some point cheated on their spouse. But is cheating just limited to physical contact? What about flirting, sexting, or fantasizing? These have been grouped into a subcategory, micro-cheating. And it all boils down to intentions. Some people flirt for an ego boost. Some people fantasize because it's fun. However, according to the micro-cheating rules, here are some examples of taking it too far. You dress up when you know you're going to see someone else. Downplaying your relationship to other people. Lying to your partner about who you're hanging out with. Saving someone under a fake name on your phone. And sharing inside jokes. Whether you think these are right or wrong, love doctors seem to all agree on one thing. Every relationship has different rules and it's a good idea to define these parameters early in to avoid future problems.